Hey guys, it's Jeremy here on Metal Music Meltdown, back with another video. What do you have for today, guys, is another collection update. Um, I did one of these recently, uh, about a week or so ago, a couple weeks ago. But I've made another purchase since then, uh, again, through CDN Records. Uh, Craig put a list up of all new stock he had uh, in, in available. And there was two titles on there that I was dying to get. I've been looking for these titles for a good price for a long time now. So I had to jump on and pull the trigger and make a purchase. And amongst the list, he had uh, a couple other titles that I really wanted to grab as well. Some bands I was familiar with, I wanted to grab more of their stuff. And there's a two or three blind buys in there of bands I just really wanted to check out based on the album cover. A lot of the ones he had in his new stock list was Thrash Metal, which is right up my alley. So I, I grabbed some of those as well, just when I made a purchase. Uh, so let's jump right in, guys, so the video's not too long. Um, the first band here is the band Insane. Uh, they're a thrash metal band out of Sweden. This is one of the blind buys I made just based on the album cover. I thought it looked really cool. I still like doing that every so often, buying an album uh, based on the cover just to check out new bands and support some underground stuff. But I haven't checked this out yet, but I'm dying to listen to it. And it also came with a sticker uh, for the band, which is really cool. A lot of these came with stickers, which is really nice. Uh, I'll eventually find a home for that on a shelf or something. And the next one here I picked up, kind of based on the album cover again, was in a band called Armory. Uh, there, I think they're also based, yeah, they're based out of Sweden. This is called Mercurion. I thought it was a really cool album cover. This is one of the new stocks he had available. They're, they're a speed metal band based out of uh, Germ or sorry, Sweden. And uh, again, just a blind buy, just something I wanted to check out. And this is their latest offering from 2022, their third uh, full length in total. So this is a brand new album from them. Definitely looking forward to that. And it also came with a sticker for the artwork, etc., which is really cool. And the next one here I picked up was the band Nocturnal. They are a black and thrash metal band from Germany. Uh, this one, unfortunately, it was a brand new album when I really when I received it. It was sealed, but unfortunately, the case broke in uh, shipping, which is fine. It happens. It's just the way it is. But I'll just replace that with a new jewel case, which is not a big deal. So again, these guys are a black and thrash metal band out of Germany. Uh, really cool artwork. I think I've heard some of their stuff in passing on YouTube. And I just wanted to grab this album. They had it on for a decent price. And uh, this is entitled uh, Serpent Death. And it's also their latest release from 2021. So I'm happy that a lot of these are the band's latest uh, releases. And it also came with the album cover sticker, which is really cool. I'll find a place for that. So yeah, the first three were kind of more blind buys, just ones I thought looked kind of cool and interesting I wanted to pick up. And uh, the rest of the ones here I was familiar with, I wanted to grab. So the first one here is the band Ice War. Uh, they're local to me, I think they're from Ottawa. Uh, they're like a traditional heavy metal, speed metal band. Uh, pretty good stuff. I have a couple of their other albums. This is their, again, their newest album called Beyond the Void from 2022, from last year, so it's pretty new. It is their fifth full length in total. I think I have two of their other albums, and I think they, uh, I think I just looked on uh, CDN this morning, I check the website often. I think uh, they have one of their album, other albums on there now that I don't have, so I'll have to make another purchase to grab that eventually. Hopefully it's still up there later on. Uh, but yeah, just a really good traditional heavy metal, speed metal band. Nothing too mind-blowing, but all their stuff I've had so far has been uh, solid. So definitely check those guys out. Always have cool artwork as well. Good stuff. And the next band was uh, Devil Cross. And this is called This Mortal, Mortal Coil. Uh, this is their debut full length from 2021. So it's still pretty current. Really cool album art artwork as well. That's the back there. And this band has um, the guy from... Uh, Haunt, which I'm a big fan of. Uh, they kind of introduced me to this band and uh, it sounds very similar to Haunt, that kind of traditional metal, uh, old school kind of rock music. It's really solid, I really enjoy it. And this is, again, I said their uh, debut, but they did have a second uh, album out last year as well. So I'm kind of interested to see if I can grab that one somewhere as well for a good price, um, for pretty solid stuff. Definitely check it out. And the last two here are the main reason I picked up the purchase. I had to have these in my collection. Along with the Double Cross and the Ice War, I really wanted those as well. Uh, but this band, Rampage, uh, they're a 
uh, thrash metal band out of uh, Australia. Uh, this is their only full-length album they released in 1988, and uh, then they split up, so they are no longer. I've been wanting this for my collection for a really long time. Really killer stuff. Uh, if you're not familiar with this band, definitely check them out and uh, head over to CDN Records and grab a copy. I think they still have some. But really good thrash metal band out of Australia. I've listened to these guys on YouTube, but every time I see a copy for the import or to buy from overseas, it's crazy expensive or the shipping kills you. And I was able to pick this up through CDN Records for like $8, which was a steal. Uh, so really good stuff. Happy I have that in my collection. And it came with a small sticker as well, which I'm really happy about. I'll definitely stick that somewhere to represent the band. And the biggest reason I made this purchase, uh, when I saw this pop up, my mouth kind of opened, my eyes went wide. I've been wanting this CD <clears throat> for a couple of years now. It's the uh, only release from the band Knife. They're a black and speed metal slash punk band out of Germany. Uh, this made my top 10 list of, I think it was 20, yeah, 2021. It's their only uh, full length to date so far. Really killer stuff. If you're into bands like Hell Ripper, um, uh, the things like that, just that kind of music or um, Midnight, like that kind of sound, you'll really enjoy this. Um, I came across these guys on uh, the new wave of old school thrash metal. It's like a channel on YouTube and I loved it right away. It made my year end list. It was just killer. And that's the inside there. Yeah, so as soon as I saw this pop up on uh, CDN as a new stock, I had to grab it right away. Definitely pick this up. I think they still have it in stock. And it also came with like a sticker, knife, uh, black leather hounds, it's called on the sticker here. Pretty cool. So I'm definitely excited I have that in my collection. I've been listening to it quite a bit the last few days. And also Craig uh, randomly elastic to my stack of CDs were these two loose discs. Uh, the first one, was uh, Evil Cult at the Darkest Night. Uh, I've actually, I've already owned that CD from a previous buy. Uh, pretty solid stuff, thrashy speed metal, traditional metal band. As you can see, it's pretty much the exact same thing there. So I'm not sure what I'll do with the second copy. I don't have a, I'll have to again buy some more jewel cases and throw it in there at least so it doesn't get damaged, but I'll throw it in this case with the other one so at least I know where it is. I'm going to give that away on a, on a giveaway or something on the channel eventually. And the other uh, band he gave me a random CD of was the band Skeletal called Bitterness and Burning Hatred. And I'll put the, a copy of the album artwork up here. Um, they're a death metal band <clears throat> out of Finland. Um, I've listened to a couple songs. It's pretty solid stuff. Not too bad. Um, I just have to get a jewel case for it uh, to put it in at least so I can put it on the shelf. Uh, so it doesn't get damaged. It's got a couple scratches already from being shipped, but still plays fine. So I'll definitely uh, check that out more soon. So guys, uh, that's it for the collection. Like I said, I ordered the seven CDs. I got two bonus CDs in there with no cases, which is really cool. Thank you to Craig, uh, Craig for that. And uh, definitely pick up the Knife and the uh, Rampage album. A lot of those uh, Ice Wars is definitely worth a listen. But, uh, and what's the other one? Devil Cross is another one you should definitely check out. Uh, like I said, the other three were more blind buys, so I'm kind of still listening to those. Uh, so yeah, let me know what you thought of the uh, collection, guys. Do you have any of these in your collection? Are there ones you're missing? And uh, definitely head over to CDN Records and make a purchase. They always have some great underground stuff over there. And until next time, guys, keep it metal.